Hello, everybody, and welcome back. Let us, I mean, I guess, finish. Potentially finish this off. Can you hear me? Must make haste. It's a strange machine. Sorry, Ko. That's everything I could bring along for you. Ah, I gotta surf there. Alright, I'm gonna, uh, fish to gain a level. Wait, is this guy... I feel like I recognize who this guy is. I see that book, nerd? Come on. Give me a bite. Ugh. The traps! Fine. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Look, I'm just looking for one level. Nearly there. I just want a full heal, you know? That's not too much to ask for, is it? A final level of 84 is not bad. focus on. The rest are going to be used for, for us just, you know, healing back up our party. There we go. He's done it! Alright. Before, this wasn't a temple. It was just an immediate fight. Where's Chow Chu? Ah, what do you mean? She's right here at our feet. And all that's left of her is this pitiful puddle. Crimsonite seems to be getting stronger every iteration, growing in tandem with our bending powers. As for you and your core stone, we can't let you continue. You seem overly strong-willed to protect your elements at all costs, so we've revised our plan with you. Now, let's shut about! No, I won't back down now, Chow Chu. Chow Chu, can you hear me? You can't give up now. 
Crow, you're too late. All your efforts have been in vain. Once an essence is lost, it's far beyond the point of no return. The other titans can't do anything anymore. They're unable to attain perfect elemental balance now. Brethren, you made it! <coughs> I can reach the stone! No, no you won't! You've gone too far now, crew. We can't allow this. This stops here. There's no place for any core stone in our future. Nor for you, Roller. We will use our bending together. Reserva, run! They are doing this! They are wielding my body as a weapon! That's right, Ran, there's a zero percent chance of surviving our bending power! Makes us undefeatable! This is amazing! Our bending power has gotten so much more powerful! Your bending merely affects my body, my essence within will never stop fighting! Dressings will feel the pain. We won't. Haha, -ha, we shall not hold back. Oh, I meant to give him a different item. Whatever. Oh, disruption's gonna hurt. Oh, just my attack? Excellent. We don't use that. Oh, splash sucks. Yes! Uh, disruption's always gonna suck the most. Oh, right, it changes what it deals damage to. Great. Red. Cliptor will die soon. <laughs> yes, the premonition still hit. Let's go. was a critical, but we got the bleed. <laughs> God, that does nothing. Impressive crow, you would have made a great Wabonia, but that option lies in the past now. Roller, let's shift our focus towards the sky. Dark particles start filling. See how you handle this storm. The odds are ever in our favor. What was that? Crow, don't give up. Together we still have a chance to break through their crimsonite chains! Them damn dark particles. I just keep knocking down Chow Chew. <laughs> Die. This will run inside. It's close. Wow, 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 wow. <coughs> Let's go. What is this? What's going on? It must be Charles Chu's essence. She's regaining bending powers? We must do something quickly, rather than supercharge this vessel with everything we have. Aha, Crow, your puny status conditions are utterly useless. Powerless against the barrier of Crimsonite. 
Heh, <laughs> you made a great mistake, bro. Hold on a little longer. They've given us an opening. That gets me. Yeah, well, my vision. No, whatever. <coughs> Don't care about your disruption. Ow, that hurt a lot. Alright, it should die to the premonition. Oh, I was so close. Starter finish things off. <laughs> Splash it! Ha <laughs> ha! Done one! Rolla, stay with me! My pending, I'm I'm losing my grip on her! This makes no sense. The pitiful elements could never be more powerful than Crimson Iron Roller. It's over. The machine was stopped prematurely. We want that enchantment child to regain control. We must leave this place for the future of the Wapaunians. Not on my watch. I refuse to let you jeopardize our planet or any other ever again. <coughs> Preserver, you did it. You came through. If it wasn't for your unwavering determination, this... Could have marked the end of Velua as we know it, so thank you, Crow. Thank you. Our combined efforts prove stronger than Crimsonite's influence because of that. The Core Stone can finally close this tumultuous chapter in history. But when we get rid of Crimsonite, what will their future hold? There's still a lot we don't know about these Wabonians. Does them already having pending powers mean there are more Titans out there? And if so, are they also threatened by this virus? For now, we must learn from this experience and show it never happens again. Not here, not anywhere. Let us focus. Let us first focus on the danger surrounding us, for the world outside is still held hostage. My brethren, our chosen preserver has fulfilled their duty. It is now up to us. Prepare yourselves, brethren. Let me rejoin our birth realm. May our elements intertwine and harmonize, breathing new life into Valua once more. Crow, close your eyes now. When you open your eyes anew, you shall behold the rebirth. Of our cherished world. Interesting. <laughs> and we're just asleep. <gasps> knock, knock. <laughs> Crow, hey there, I heard you've been taking a nice little rest these past couple days. Please, take all the time you need to recuperate. You earned it. By the way, all your friends at Lux Souls chipped in to put together a special care package for you. There's not enough gold in the world to thank you, but well, we gave it a shot. Everyone hopes to see you back at Waxen. There are some real remarkable discoveries taking place. Stuff that's beyond your wildest dream. Some of us theorize it'll take a couple years, at least, but eventually. How about another adventure together? A SPACE ADVENTURE! And speaking of space adventure, Koromon has announced their second game. That is right. Koromon already has a sequel announced. Uh, I'm looking for it right now. <coughs> a threat still lingers. Return to Valua in 2025. There is a spin off. Not a sequel, but we've got Coromon Rogue Planet. It is a rogue-like game. So what they have to say is Coromon Rogue Planet combines the rich strategy of a tactical turn-based combat from Coromon with the strategic rogue-like gameplay to create an endlessly replayable monster-taming gameplay experience. Think, uh... <sighs> 
<laughs> what we had already done earlier with that other uh, game, which I don't remember off the top of my head because I have the brain of a memory. What? I don't know. Uh, what was it called? It wasn't Myth on Island. It was the one we did before that. <coughs> I'll look it up in a minute. But, uh, explore a variety of ten ever-changing biomes. Make tactical decisions on which paths to take as you navigate different events across the planet of Malua. Weighing risk and reward, each biome contains new and interesting challenges as well as its own biosphere of Koromon. Procedurally generated maps, encounters, and rewards ensure that every run feels fresh and new. And new. Unlike seven different playable characters, each with their own story and playstyle. As you navigate through Balua's diverse wildlands, you'll find other trainers and you have helped join forces with them to permanently unlock them as a playable character and complete milestone goals, discover their stories, and gain new bonuses for every successive run. Battle, catch, and tame over 130 monsters. Each Koromon has their own mix of elemental affinities, personality, traits, and skills. Work together with your team of Koromon to improve their skills, trailer their moveset, and grow their power. <laughs> then battle against wild Koromon trainers, holds, and more! So collect resources to fall further Lux Solus' journey to the stars on your travels. You'll encounter the mysterious remains of an interstellar spaceship. Each time you bring back new info and resources from these encounters, not only will Lux Solus reward you with additional funding, but you'll be working together with other players to progress a global narrative and unlock the secrets of the galaxy. Which is basically them saying, as you work on this, we're working on our own. Oh! Oh, there's a note in here. Well, Delcrat, we hope you'll be back on your feet soon. P.S. You should really check out the newly opened battle dome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's something. We also got ourselves a radiant, or a perfect gem. Which I don't actually know what a perfect gem do. If I had to guess, it's a one-time use item. Upgrade any. Karma to perfect potential. Ah! Crow, now that you've saved the world, you can finally clean your room. I'm kidding, honey. Take some time off. Play some video games with Dexter. No. But yeah, that is the story of Koromon. What did you guys think of the brand new ending? If you didn't remember last time, the ending was Chalchu was corrupted and trying to attack you. Uh... But in the end, you do stop Chaochu, and um, when they reunite, you find out the Wabonians actually, their planet only had Crimsonite, and that they lost their planet, and that Lux Solus wants to work together with the Wabonians to create a brand, an environment for them to live here in Valua since they could not return to their home world. Uh, Clearly, they changed that for the Wabonians to be utterly evil, utterly, uh, uh, reprehensible, and, like, no hope for them at all. So, I guess that is the end of the Wabonians' tale. There is no redeeming them. At least in this game, this time. Uh, if you don't really know what I'm talking about, take a look at one of the other two uh, full playthroughs I did of this game. This is our fourth playthrough of this full game. Uh, my very, very first playthrough was obviously just uh, the demo for it. The second full playthrough was um, uh, just a vanilla playthrough with no modifiers. Uh, the third playthrough was a randomizer. <clears throat> and then, of course, this playthrough, which was after their numerous story updates, overhaul updates. We got the, quote, mobile update, which added in the mobile features, which were, you know, the whole, like, style shop and, like, daily milestones in order to... Whatever. Um. So... I mean, who really knows uh, what else they could do? 
But, I mean, we've kind of got all of the Koromon... I mean, not actually officially all the Koromon caught or anything, because, um, unfortunately, my save that I did have it all is now gone, so... I mean, that is the way that the cookie will be crumbling in that aspect, so... Not much I can do about it now. But, I mean, yeah. Is what it is, so... Uh, not a whole lot more to say on that. Uh, give me my headgear and my lap coat. Ugh, take off the outfit. You know what? We'll go witch hat. Lab coat. Ding dong! Accent granted. Some remarkable discoveries have been taking place, providing us with answers on how the Warbonians managed to travel here. Some of us theories will take a couple years to unravel the intricacies of this newfound technology, at least when the time comes. I sincerely hope you'll be around again for another adventure. Are they all in here? They must be feeling blue. Mm -hmm. So this guy... I want to go check. But I think I recognize him. Who's this guy? I don't know. I've been hearing rumors about the Titan Task Force embarking on an extraordinary mission to outer space. Yeah, yeah. I love how they managed to get an anti-bending, like, technology created so quickly. Uh, and getting the achievement for getting a 100 on the push module is just BS. Anyway, the guy in the headband reminds me of somebody we met early, 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 early on. And the only reason I remembered it is because I actually saw it pop up a little bit ago. So let's take a look. It was uh, the nerd in Hayville who challenged you to a reading competition, or a knowledge competition. So I'm just here to check up on that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, but with that, that will be the end for Koromon. Uh, you may have noticed that I have not been uploading on Sundays. I'm taking a little break. I'm kind of burnt out. And I want to focus on some other things for a bit. Nope, this nerd's still right here. It's not him. Cool. Uh, and I will also be doing the same for Tuesdays and Thursdays. So for... The next while, you will only be getting the Nuzlocke challenge, the Nuzlocke series on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and the Digimon series for a little bit. I'm a little burnt out. I'm uh, wanting to focus on some things on myself and some other things, but um, I continue. I plan to continue being around for a while. So anyway, thank you everybody for watching. I hope you all enjoyed and. Until the next time, everybody. Stay funky, people.